I want to be able to rotate an image so that it always faces the same way up. And that's what I've got happening here. So here are the results. Let me get the other windows positioned so that we can see a bit more. Uh, this top left shows the original frame that I'm reading from a webcam. The second window is the darknet YOLO output. The window at the bottom here just shows a bunch of debug information. And the window on the right is the result. This is running in my VM. Uh, so darknet YOLO is running using CPU only, not GPU. And on top of it, the webcam access through the VM is kind of slow. But no matter how I turn the playing card, you can see the window on the right side. The card will always be upright. So it is rotated however way it needs to be ro rotated to show up the same way. Uh, there's other ways of doing this in OpenCV. For example, with the nice flat background that I've got, you could easily get the contour, and from the contour you can figure out the angle. Um, but in real world images, you don't normally have such nice even backgrounds. You might get a lot of texture, or there might be other objects in play, uh, in which case... If you're already using object detection, like you're using Darknet YOLO to find things in your image, then it's trivial to say, well, at the same time that we're finding these things, why don't we also find some corners or find some particular edge or find some kind of landmark in the image that you can use to figure out which way it's aiming so that you can apply some rotation. And uh, the rotation that I use is very typical uh, OpenCV technique. Let me quickly jump to that. I'm going to show you the source code. There's, you know, 116 lines of code here, of which maybe 20 are relevant to figuring out uh, the angle and then rotating the image. Uh, first thing we do is we load the neural network, set a bunch of parameters. We open up the webcam here. And then we begin a while loop. We read in the frame. This line here is where we call the neural network to get it to do all of the fancy things that Darknet YOLO does. It's just that one line. And then we take all of the predictions that uh, came out of Darknet YOLO. Uh, we take the, um, the coordinates of all of the corner rectangles and we insert them in a OpenCV contour. And you'll see why here, in this line here, we take that contour and we tell OpenCV, tell me what the rotated rectangle is for all of these points in the contour. Then at that point, it's just a matter of uh, figuring out exactly um, what the rotation angle needs to be. We create the rotation matrix here, and this is where we rotate the image. After that, we just we show the four images that we have, and we wait for the user to press a key. So like I said, there are easier ways of doing it, except if you don't have a nice uniform background to work with, in which case this is probably the easiest way to do it. Hope this helps. Uh, come join us on the Darknet YOLO Discord if you have any questions or suggestions. Thanks.